That's well played. So Greg Matthews off the mark. Ball rolling away down towards square leg. Will it get to the boundary? Oh, and uh, Hadley very nearly went over on his ankle there. Try to put his foot into it and uh, drag it back. I think he succeeded in doing that in the end. But that could very easily have ended up in a twisted ankle. Five for 77. A shout there from Vaughan Brown. It's five for 90. And that's a good shot from Greg Matthews. I think at the moment Ewan Chatfield's working away at a leg stump attack. He feels that uh, perhaps Matthews is getting a little too far across towards the offside and leaving leg stump exposed. That three to Matthews brings up the 100. Right, well that means Border is uh, gaining in confidence in his partner, taking the single so Matthews can have the strike, trying to rotate it, keep the bowler off balance. Last ball of Chatfield's over. Tucked away, down to deep fine leg. Matthews looking for the second and going as Hadley's return comes in, high and hard but too high. Matthews safely home as the over comes to an end, 113 runs on the board for a loss of five minutes. While the irrepressible Matthews warmed up in the steamy Brisbane heat, Coney tried to increase the pressure, but Matthews had the perfect reply. We'll pick up a couple there, and it may even be a double couple. Quick to take advantage of the full toss, as indeed the New Zealanders were when the Australians bowled them. Be careful the ball doesn't spin back on him in the drive. It's a good shot. Uh, three more to Greg Matthews, takes him on to 34. Four to 51. And Australia move on towards the 130 mark. Once again over-pitched and Matthews making no mistake with those full tosses. He gets down the wicket every now and again. And actually turned that one into a full toss but hit it very well. Well played pitch of that one too and worked it away on the onside as a result we'll collect three and keep the strike five for 140 he's cut that one away and so this should bring up Matthews's 50 the second 50 in test cricket and that's well played a good fighting knock by Matthews Goes the maker's name, the crowd applaud. Greg Matthews, a very excitable character. Very happy. We enjoy afternoon tea now. The war paint's on. Except at the, uh, the occasion. Didn't move out of that crease at all. That's a good shot. Nice piece of timing. Sometimes gets himself into a bit of a tangle, Greg Matthews in trying to hit that ball a bit too square, I think, the one from around about leg stump. But on that occasion, he got it very nicely. New Zealand bowlers have been aiming at that leg stump. And I don't think that Greg Matthews minds too much. He's picked up a lot of runs with shots uh, clipped off his toes. And those three bring up the 100 stand. Full toss and Nicely guided away there by Greg Matthews. So runs coming thick and fast for the Australian team for the first time in this match. That's a good shot. The chase will have to be done by the man at uh, mid-off, Hadley. And Matthews will come back for three. Good running. Good response from Border. Delightful stroke, good timing, and just about perfect placement. Three more to Greg Matthews. With this run, he passed his previous highest test score of 75. 
Played a superb innings, great support innings. And that's going in the air down towards the fieldsman over there, just over his head. Well, he wants to be a little careful of that one too. He's played so well. And uh, taking chances at this late stage could result in him losing his wicket. He's hit that one nicely. Way over the square leg head. And down towards the boundary. And that puts Matthews into his 90s. He joins Alan Border. Just 10 runs away from 100. At 150 partnership. 270 deliveries in 182 minutes, and that's an excellent time. That went played down into the ground. There's no third man, so four runs to Matthews. That takes him to 94. And that's the great value of playing on this game, on this ground up here at the Gabba. He really just made contact with the, the bat on that one, rolled the wrists, and I think he got a surprise to see that uh, there was no one down a third man that he was going to pick up four runs. So he moves four runs closer to picking up 100 in a test match. He's gone for it, it's down the ground, this could be six. It's his first 100 and is he happy? It's a beautiful six to bring up his 100. Well, isn't he enjoying it? I think we're lucky staying on the ground. A well, tremendous effort by the off spinner. And Tony, I think it's the first time ever I've seen a fellow who's looking for 100 when he hit the ball ran the other way. You normally find them running up and down looking for the, the one or the two or the three, but he knew it was right up the middle of the bat and it was going to go over that boundary rope. Great shot. Well, he's hit, uh, he's hit A6. And uh, ten fours, and I don't think that he's hit a better boundary shot than that one. Well, as happens so often, that ball being you flying off the bat. 110 runs behind, Australia. Edged and gone. Jeremy Coney, the second slip specialist, has ended a magnificent partnership. Just three runs short of the 200. Greg Matthews out his first ever test century.